The Reveni are an alien culture that has come to this world to wage war from another one. You can see scraps of their culture all over them, from the war paint that decorates their body to the kind of primitive weapons and clothing and things that they wear. They're trying to take over this land, and they're rampaging through the world trying to exterminate all of humanity. You'll be running into a wide variety of opponents that require very different tactics in order to defeat. Fortunately, Avil has access to a whole bunch of different kinds of skills that can make these battles easier. The gold armor is actually impervious to Avil's rune strike, except for a series of latches that hold it on. One of the properties of the gold armor is that it's very friendly for Avil's whip, and he can use it like a grappling hook to pull himself all around it. And so it's often much quicker to fight them by leaving the armor on and whipping from one piece to the next. The iron armor is also completely impervious to Avil's rune strike, except for these dangling locks. And Avil has to actually aim his rune strike at these locks and hit them as they're moving through the air, uh, potentially at very high speeds as the ogre is swinging his limbs around trying to stomp on you. It can take multiple hits to actually take out the locks themselves, so even just hitting them once isn't necessarily good enough. But one of the upgrades that Avil can get makes it so that's not true anymore, and he only needs to hit them once in order to be able to take them out. The bone armor is actually decked out in these flaming skulls, and in order to disable the magical field that protects them, you have to put out the fire that's in their eyes. Now, the only thing that can actually put out that fire is the shockwave from one of the Reveni's attacks. Avil only has a brief window to actually be able to destroy the armor once that fire goes out. But upgrading his ability to slow down time makes it much easier to get in there and take it out without that fire reigniting. Similarly, the spiked armor ogres have all of these parts all over them where Avil cannot land or he will be damaged. Getting the abilities that allows him to better control the rates at which he falls makes it a lot easier to bait out its attacks, dodge them at the last second, and keep doing this until the stress breaks up enough that that armor actually shatters. The absolute scariest form of the Raveni armor is actually the bright steel armor. This armor is impossible for Avil to destroy, and that means that if there's any particular part of a Raveni that is protected by bright steel armor, you cannot dismember whatever that part of him is. And if you find a Raveni that is decked out in this way, you may not actually be able to kill it. You may need to achieve your mission objectives in a different way, say by leading it away from the area. If he runs into a Raveni that has bright steel leggings on, he won't be able to cut off that ogre's legs and bring it down to him. Instead, he's going to have to fight it while it's standing. And so skills that enable him to jump higher, climb further, or generally make it easier for him to traverse the Raveni while it's standing up will be much more effective than they would against other ogres where he might be able to actually dismember the legs. We're really excited for you guys to be able to get a hold of Extinction. It's coming out early 2018 for PC, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One.